This is the Nerd Herd Noobs here, and we are Grapple Challenged. Okay, that didn't make sense. Anyway, so we are going to switch up things a little bit. So we have a new, not a new permanently, but a helper for the gaming device. And here she is, if she can tear her mind away from this. Yeah, the mic didn't reach that far. Anyway, so she is not used to playing with the GameCube remote. She, they, never mind, I'll go to him. Okay, so um, as Ben was saying, um, we have an N64 and she is used to playing it on that because the controller is quite a bit different than the GameCube controller, which is what we're using. So um, she's actually way better than what she'll be playing with. Like, the, the controllers, she's not really used to it yet, but she, yeah, she's better than all of us at this game, by the way. And I just noticed that platform looks like a rupee from Zelda. We'll try to show you it. The, the starting platform does. Yes! Rupee! But I guess rupees have pointy ends. I think one half of that had a pointy end, but the other one was flat, I think. What's up? And this is actually one of the one of the 100 point stars that will give you a lot of trouble. Just because if you get sucked into the sand um, that's surrounding like the tox box, the tox box is over there, or the sand that's surrounding the pyramid, um, you will die, definitely. Like, you can't avoid it. You will die if you get sucked into that sand. Almost had a runaway coin there. Just like our runaway mic. <laughs> yeah, the pokies, you can kill them in a few ways. You can just keep punching them, like their bottom area like where their feet are and like punch them five times and that should like kill them or you can what i do is jump and kick them in the air and like if you kick them in the head then they'll die in one hit and you can jump on their heads which will work too and they give you a blue coin as you may have seen so we're gonna try and get as many coins as possible in the actual course and then we'll go in the pyramid once we have around maybe 60 or something like that. Because I know the blue coin block of the level um, is actually inside the pyramid, so that'll give you like 15 coins, I believe this one gives you. It might be 10, but I'm not sure. Oh yeah, that's what that tornado was. I don't think we showed that. Yeah, but there's another pokey. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, you. That was scary. 35 coins, yay. By the way, we redid this video a few times because we really stink at doing this. So hopefully we'll be able to complete it in our first try for you guys this time. We seem to be off to a good start, but we've died after this point too, which is sad. I think the farthest we got was like 55 coins and we didn't even get inside the pyramid yet. So once we're signed in the, inside the pyramid, we're pretty much home free. Yeah, except it's not baseball. <laughs> Haha, <laughs> it's really funny. Never mind, that didn't make sense. Never mind, I was thinking of home run. I'm so stupid. Home free is a different game that professional people don't play. That's why we play it. Get it? We play? That's a, it's a Wii game? No one's laughing. I'm so excited that the E3 announced all that stuff. Oh, the new Smash Bros. Yeah, and I heard that they're actually coming out with um, Legend of Zelda Awakening of Link, I think. Or the thing for free on the 3DS or Wii. Yeah, he's talking about Link's Awakening, I think, for the Game Boy Color. They released it on the eShop. And in case you're wondering why we're talking about E3, when it'll be like June when we post, I mean, it'll be like early July when we post this video. It's because we're recording this in like mid-June. So yeah, in case you're wondering there. Yeah, we usually do all the recordings like early before we post them, so yeah. 
so we go into the cannon and shoot into the sky for the uh, eight red coins. So I think we'll be, um, I think we'll get around 60 before we go into the pyramid, like exactly. Because I think there's four red coins in the sky and I think we might get like one extra. Yeah, that's really agitating. When Mario gets so much momentum that he goes like flying up. These coins are very agitating. But there's one. Oh yeah, we're gonna end with exactly 60 if she gets all these. Come on, come on, losing altitude. Oh, oh. <laughs> She's just going to the other <coughs> red hat box. Flying hat, not red hat, winged cap thing. Yeah, and I think she's gonna launch herself with the cannon again, too. Mario's just going at a very slow pace right now. Yeah. Unfortunately, you can't control the speed. So, yeah, we have 54 coins. Oh, that was skill. That was awesome. That was a beaut. A real beaut. So. Last coin. Last red coin, actually. And then we'll have 60, and then we can go into the pyramid. Da, da, da. And there's the red coin star, but we aren't going to get that reasons that you guys should know. Oh no, we're not going to go into exactly 60. Oh well. Yeah. Makes a difference. The more the merrier. Yes, yes, we're, yes, we're going to make it into the pyramid. Yes, okay, we're home free now. No, don't, don't, don't try, don't try for it. What's up? All right, we should be good now. Oh, I'm so happy. We kept dying. There we go. The blue coin block. All right. Just trade off players so we can get all the blue coins correctly. There. So yeah, it's just three, the three blue coins right there, and there's none other. So as we did in our other 100 coin stars, we're gonna try as best we can to get exactly 100. There are the devious toilet paper rolls again. They're probably mummies, not toilet paper rolls. But 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 mummies are wrapped in toilet paper roll. <laughs> Good point. Touche. And they have an awesome smile on their face. It's like. <gasps> But it does look kind of evile as well. Yes, I believe there's three mummified toilet paper rolls. So yeah. There's actually probably four or so. Yeah, there's a rolling one. Hmm. So now we will get sooner or later 100 coins and uh, another toilet paper roll of death back there except he looks kind of happy for death except he's kind of got eyebrows that look a bit menacing right Sorry for that, but um, you can get a few coins on the monkey bars as well. Oh, that bee just saved her. It looks like a bee though, and it sounds like a bee, so I'm gonna call it a bee, even though it's called like an amp. It's actually called a sparky or an amp or something. And then there is a zap on the top. On the top. So yeah. We have seven more coins to get. 
93, and we have seven more coins. Long jump. 94, so now we have six coins left. <gasps> oh. <clears throat> Bye. Yes, this makes me happy, considering the fact that we kept failing. It's taken us about 10 minutes and 40 seconds. Uh-oh. So yeah, the, that's a kind of menacing position of the star, and I get guess Nintendo was very rude on that. <coughs> and we're going to try to not get to 101 coins again, even though we did get to 101 on the booze level. Sorry about that. Because the booze level is quite hard to get exactly 100. There we go. Yeah! Do, 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 do. Now... Now we will find a menacing way to die. Or we'll just exit the course and get to the next world. But we're not going to start the one at the coin star. Okay, so I think that that is it for this video. So, we're just going to get to Dire Dire Docks and then Ben will do the classic. Since no one else can and I'm the only pro one who can actually sing. Yes. I'm just gonna get the coin thingy. Never mind, not coin. Okay, so always remember to subscribe. <laughs>